Hey everybody, look, welcome to Rudimist uh, 301. I don't feel like wearing makeup, so I'm wearing a bag over my head. So let's do this quick because I'm running out of air. I couldn't breathe because there was a bag over my head. But okay, now you've seen my face. So let's get one thing straight. You might recognize me. So if any of you say anything, you might get a visit. Understand what I'm saying? So just to keep this on the this is just between us YouTubers. Okay? Don't tell nobody nothing. I can get dangerous. And you know what? Oh. I can't breathe in this thing. Oh yeah. I just can't breathe. Oh, yeah. I gotta take this so much. I still can't breathe. What do I take off now? Oh man. All right, now that I can breathe, let's do this. It's going to be Rudiments 301. I think I think that's what I said, didn't I, when I had to, when I couldn't breathe the bag on the head with the stuff? I don't know. Uh, what we're going to talk about this time is called touch. Touch is basically this. You know what I mean? Uh, in in uh, in speaking and such is called inflections, such as you can take the word "hey" and you can say it like this: "Hey," or you can say like "Hey." Or you can say like, "Hey, uh, you know, hey." All those kind, of, those those are inflections. Those are touches. Well, drumming is the same way. Any any music is with any instrument. It's all inflections and touch. And what I'm going to do today is I'm going to teach you an exercise that helps the mind and the body learn about touch. Okay. Now this is an exercise in how to. Uh, applicate touch not how to determine in the music what should be that just comes with experience or whatever and it's going to go like this just because you're playing from this height doesn't mean that it needs to be like that it can be like this so do this rudiment this is this is for uh, mallet players also and you know and all you people in the pit you can also do the same thing okay now this is not meant to be a perfect exercise it is not meant to be something that 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 comes out exactly right every time you might miss notes you might have 
different inflections, heights might might vary or whatever, but it's a training tool for the brain and the body, okay? We're going to play pianissimo, right, like this. Of course, we know that. We're going to play uh, fortissimo or double fortissimo like this. Sure, we all know that, okay? Well, what if we swap it? What if we want to play forte way down here? And what if we want to play pianissimo up here? And if you notice the faces I'm making, because it, it's it's hard. You, it's it's weird. So try to do something like this, and you, and you can just do this over and over. Just keep it going and see what you can do. Okay, start pianissimo. And just, just watch what I do, and then try to emulate it, and, and you'll learn on your own how it goes, okay? playing soft and then getting louder at it. and yeah my stick heights will a very little bit I can see it in the screen and you but you learn you know like to squeeze and such and you learn to control your stroke up here that just because you're up here da -da 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 -da, it's not like that it can be da -da 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 -da. Uh, let me see there's uh you could do this uh, let's see um this short because it's really one of those training tools that you really learn for yourself. One of them little extra things you do that's off to the side. It doesn't have to do with, with rudiments or scales and all that other stuff. It's just something else to help the brain learn what's going on. One hand's a great way to do it also, you know. So that's just a little something to uh, help you doodle around and uh, do some extra stuff. Hope it was fun me choking in the beginning because it wasn't fun for me. I still can't breathe because I'm breathing out of my mouth right now. Did I mess up my makeup? Oh, my Lord. Oh, look at that. Oh, no. Oh, come on, really? But this side still looks fabulous, don't you think? Oh, well, that's kind of hot, man. Huh. A little sting-ish, huh? You know who sting is? Do you know who sting is? Yes, I know who Sting is. Do you know who Sting is? Yes, no, yes, no, yes, no, yes, no. All right. Hey, have fun. Uh, work on that. It's really an easy concept, but it's very hard to do that sort of thing, and it, it's, it's very hard to actually apply. So uh, just have fun with it. Start now. That way, you know, you're getting an early start. And uh, have fun with it. And remember, it's just drums. Thanks.